Hey, hey guys, welcome back to my channel. If you're new, welcome. Okay, so my previous video, well, not previous, I don't know. I don't know when this is gonna be. Up. My green hair tutorial, I told you guys I'll show you how I got the cut when I did the cut in that hair. So I show you how I got these highlights, partial highlights in this hair, which I'm really, really loving. And um, I also show you how I did my long layer haircut. Yeah, this hair was sent to me from D Sor Hair Company. This is a packaging. It's so so pretty. So in the package came three bundles of 16-inch Brazilian body wave, I think. Yeah, body wave and a 16-inch frontal. Um, I did cut this hair, as you guys told you, did a haircut. And in the package, I totally forget to record how the packaging look. I'm not really a sucker for packaging. Well. A little bit but not to the extent as some people so I didn't I totally forget to show you the packaging of how everything came it came very very pretty I only used two bundles and the front of and this is how the hair came in the packaging um, the ends are really really nice actually show you. The ends are really really nice like, Yeah, and came in the packaging came with a mink eyelash as well. I was like, look at you guys. Normally they send you those ugly lashes that you feel like, what am I gonna do with them? But I'm actually gonna wear these. So yeah, um, I really love the hair. Took the hair lightener very well. Um, body weight, the movement, everything. I didn't even deep condition my hair like how I normally do with the microwave and a plastic bag etc i didn't even do that and the hair feels so nice no tangles i guess it, it doesn't even shed like there it is so i'm loving this so if you want to see how i got this haircut and how i did these highlights please stay tuned and take care and i'll see you in my next one bye so i'm just going to show you how i'm going to give this wig some highlights and well foils highlight a partial highlight i should say for this, I'm going to be using two hand liner. I'm using the BW2 and then I'm using lightener is ideal for creating cool tone blonde highlights and dark brown or dark blonde hair. And this is like dark brown. So I'm going to mix these and I'm going to go ahead and use Paul Mitchell Cream Developer in volume 30. Also, I'm going to be using some foils and this one is from Renault Foils. Um, I think I might use about 35 foils. So yeah, so I'm using my foiling comb. For this, I'm going to have one, two, three, four section on the sides and then one in the middle. So I'm going to do rectangle or square, square right here. So this is going to be one of my section. I'm going to just tie away this. I'm not going to do any color into the bottom part. Next, um, I'm going to make one section right here. In a middle section. And I'm going to do the same thing. And I want to ensure that both sides are equal. So this is the section one, two, three, four, and then one around right in the crown area. Right, the crown area. So this is how we're gonna foil. So I have my foils. If you don't know what the foils look like, these are how they look. Sheets of foils. It has like some rough edges on it. I don't know if you can see. Yeah, so it has some kind of like rough edges. So it gives the hair something to kind of stick instead of sliding off. I have my lightener well mixed. And it's a creamy consistency. 
so now it's time to just have my boiling comb i'm gonna put take out like quarter in section i think this is too wide you know guys so i'm gonna take out some because i think this is way too wide this is my first section clip away that and then i'm going to weave some of the hair out so scissors fingers then i'm gonna use my comb and i'm gonna go weave i'm gonna weave it now so it's like up down up down up down obviously i do this way faster but and then whatever is on top that's what i'm gonna lift and this I'm gonna back comb this part because I want it to be even and always so I'm back comb in a fit bit. So I'm gonna back comb it just a little, not too much, just so it blends better. After I back comb, I'm going to take up my foil, take up my foil, and then I'm gonna put this focus. I'm gonna put this under right here. All right, like that. Then I'm gonna go for my lightener and place it on, release, pull the, the foil, and then And I have to saturate, ensure the hair is well saturated. So now it's well saturated, I'm going to pull the foil up. Just like this. Put in my hands, and I'm going to use the back of the comb. And I don't do it that much, I leave space for it to process and then I fold again. And I use the comb and I fold the two sides. And that's how I do my foil. So let's do another one. I'm gonna shake out another section. And then weave. So I'm gonna pretty much continue doing all these section this way. So for this one, just doing all of them going down. Um, whenever I reach to the side, then I'll come back and stop the video and show you guys. Okay, okay so this is what it looks like. I have one, two, three, four, five foils for the back. So now I'm going to the side. Um, for the side, I'm going to do the part in diagonal like this and then same thing for this one going up so I'm going to start with the right side and as I said I'm going to part away from the face diagonal so that's going to be my first section
Okay, so for the top section, front part, I'm gonna do the same thing, diagonal sectioning. By the way, the last one, when I reach to the, this last one right here, I leave this. I didn't, I didn't, um, for this one, I just left it. I'm gonna do the same sectioning, diagonal. So I'm gonna finish that. Okay guys, I'm finished. And this is how it looks. So I have these two sections in the top that I didn't color. So I'm gonna let her process for 30 minutes or 35 minutes and then I'll wash her out. Okay, so it's been like 45 minutes. So I'm gonna check and see. Okay, I think I like these. So I'm gonna remove them and wash the hair because i like them okay guys so i'm finished and this is how it looks i don't know i'm just gonna turn it and i'm using i'm going to use willow t18 and just a, a drop like a literally a drop of willow cool violet and 050 so i'm gonna mix these together and I don't have a 20 volume developer, so I'm gonna use the 30 volume. I'll let it sit for like 20 minutes and then I'll come back. Okay guys, so this is how the hair looks after I um, tone it and I did the haircut. Um, don't forget to stay tuned for the next video. I'm going to show you how I did the haircut. I really didn't want this video to be way too long and it's already long. So I decided to just split this video in two instead of, you know, drawing it out. If you like this video, don't forget to subscribe to my channel and give this video a thumbs up. So this will indicate that you want to see how I did those, did the cut. Um, so yeah, guys, take care and I'll see you in my next one. Bye.